I've been having a lot of questions about using trailing stops. Here's a suggestion for you to practice. It doesn't mean that you don't pull your trade when you start seeing red candles or the STC goes against you, but in order to run that trade out as long as it will go and not just setting a good till canceled sell order it up 20%, 5%, 2%, whatever it is, and out, how do you run that trade on? Consider, consider using your average true range, just at one time, average true range as your trailing stop. Now again, don't forget, you still have to watch your trade. If it turns against you, there's no reason taking a loss if you don't have to, but if it's running on, 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 you can reduce that as things go higher and higher, so you'd end up, you don't end up losing that one average true range that you started with. And all you have to do is look at average true range, whatever the number is, if it's 70 cents or $1.50, whatever it might be, you can put that in as your trailing stop. Just a suggestion. It doesn't work all the time. Some stocks or ETFs it's not good for, but my friends, that is why you practice every day. And that is why before you ever consider using real money, you learn backwards and forwards the stocks and ETFs that you want to trade. God bless.